It is football season. We're back down in Lewiston. It's about 10 degrees cooler this year, and the guys will be down here for nine days. It's the first of the nine-day fall camp start. Every day we'll be down here. We'll do our post-fall camp reports. We'll talk to Coach Leach every day. We'll try to get a coach and a couple of players. Today we'll speak with Coach Leach, Alex Grinch, Luke Falk, and Peyton Pelour. Is it different this year? I mean, you know, you're talking about how they look up to you, and you're one of the guys out there that's leading the team now because you're a junior and you've been here before Jeremiah's moved on so it's your linebacking unit for sure is it different than last year or is it similar to the way it got toward the end of the season I mean Jeremiah was super vocal but we, we got studs um, all over in, in linebacker uh, we're, we're, we're deep and so it makes it easier on me and, and you know the guys are, are getting smarter every day I'm I'm getting better every day we're all getting better um, so that, that makes my job easier and that makes this defense be, uh, better try to have the same approach every year, you know, compete and stuff like that. And last year I felt like, uh, you know, it was still my team and, you know, I just needed to go out there and prove it every day. And, you know, same thing this year, same exact approach and, you know, just got to earn it every day. What's it like having Gabe and the comfort that you must have with a guy like that on the team? You know, I think, uh, you know, you're in a bad situation, you throw it up to him and, you know, really all our guys are, are key players for us this year. and. You know, I think they're all doing a nice job. We had a you know pretty good first day today, and you know good to see some young guys making plays. You know, throw it up to X over there, and you know they made some great plays. But you know, having Gabe, having guys like River, having guys, you know, I could name them all. But you know, it's just nice. We're here with Alex Grinch, the defensive coordinator. 11 points per game improvement, uh, 27 or so points per game last year allowed. Do you have metrics? Do you have marks that you want to hit in terms of number of turnovers, number of points, number of yards, and do those details allow you to get more specific with those? Well, you know, our, our number one goal is to you know hold uh, opponents to one less point than when our offense scores. I mean, that, and that that doesn't matter. You know, uh, if if we you know we score 14 points, we got to hold them to 13, and that's the agreement that you have on a, on a football team. Um, you know, but but obviously you you know there, there's certain numbers that we, we share amongst uh, you know our team. Um, and, and some things to be aware of. But the biggest thing is, you know, obviously you want to play good situational defense. And so those are the things kind of we focus on with our guys. There's, there's some things that you focus on as coaches uh, that doesn't translate as well as when you communicate with players. Do they feel that? Well, obviously uh, we don't want to give up points. You know, thanks, Coach, for the reminder. I mean, we did it. The, uh, but but there, there's situational defense, how we play in the red zone, you know, how, how you do on third downs. Obviously fight for the football in every single snap. You know, takeaways win football games. Um, so certainly the, the, those things uh, are, are important uh, uh, every single day in practice and, and obviously carries over in the game. I, I was excited about the effort. Some guys trying to do a little too much, so they'll settle down. But we had great effort, I thought. And then, uh, uh, you know, pretty sharp, I thought, for a first day and sharper than last year. And so uh, we got a lot of work to do. That's clear. But we got a lot of good film today, so we can uh, get started with that tonight. We got to give Gabe a happy birthday shout out right now. So, you know, happy happy birthday, Gabe.